Hi, my name is Katherine Logan, and I've been an AAOS member since my last year of medical school in 2011. I sought out the FAOS designation because I think it really represents a commitment to quality and professional development. It also sets me apart from other people on the musculoskeletal team and lets others know that I'm committed to my education and my overall professional development. Outside of my FAOS designation, there's a lot that I really do value about being an AOS member. I'm very involved in committee work and that helps me feel involved in the community. It also pushes me to continue to learn and develop my practice and clinical skills. I also really enjoy the quality and practice management sections to really learn about the business side of medicine, which helps me be a more well-rounded clinician. The FAOS designation as a member benefit really just brings recognition to the profession as a whole. It helps signify standing in the community and lets others know that um, there's a seriousness to commitment of quality in clinical care as well as professional development and continuing education. With regarding how I plan to use my FAOS designation, um, I've added it to my practice and hospital websites. I use it in presentations. Um, I've noticed that the media staff at my hospital also uses it in media releases. And then I think you can also add it to your business cards, email signatures, as well as you know, signify your commitment to education on your social media presence and profiles. As far as to my colleagues who are considering becoming an FAOS member, I would say go for it. It's a straightforward process with transparency, it's free, um, and it really does help set us apart from others in the musculoskeletal care space and really shows your commitment to continuing education and your professional development, so go for it. I think it's important for all members to consider getting the FAOS designation. I do think in the broad musculoskeletal space, it's important to set us apart from other people with competing interests and let people in the community know um, about our dedication to professionalism and continuing education, as well as our dedication to the orthopedic surgery practice.